and I guess we are right here there we are right there so it's where two beaches intersect and this is Playa Blanca Playa Grande yes that is the beach there and it is a beautiful day today And you can see it's pretty busy here in Lanzarote today. Buccaneers restaurant over there, shenanigans just behind. So it's, it's amazing to see all the tourists here. And I've heard so many people from different nationalities, uh, French, German, Italian. I've heard people speaking Swedish as well. So you, it's really a mixed bag. And I've had a great 24 hours being in Lanzarote you know first I met Judy and Mark from the Gypsy Souls which was amazing I just met them by chance check out my video I basically heard Judy laughing from like halfway down the road and I thought hang on I recognize that voice and then I ran down and it was actually her how amazing is that so um you know, Judy, if you're watching this, it was like super nice to meet you. Like, what, what a great personality she is, uh, you know, both on screen and even more so in person. And she took a bit of time to talk to me and, you know, we, we, we shared a few laughs. So that was, that was an awesome chance experience. And then last night I ended up at the Palm Bay bar and lo and behold i bumped into vince ph who's like like one of my favorite he's like my favorite youtuber here in lanzarote and i've been watching his videos for so long and you know just love the daily walks that he does with the weather updates and absolutely superb so it was amazing meeting vince and vince like again like he's he's amazing on screen and in person he's just absolutely super nice and he took a bit of time to come and talk to me and um, we shared some ideas about future youtube productions and future youtube videos and yeah we just talked about tech stuff so that was just an amazing experience meeting vince and again he's just super nice so friendly and you know i want to thank all the guys at the restaurant as well too you know they are super cool i was there a couple of months ago uh, i didn't manage to meet him but i did last night so yeah it was just super amazing meeting vince that's like really the icing on the cake here so i am in puerto de carmen and um, yeah just super awesome like Vince is a great guy I hope we can stay in touch you know and if I'm back in Lanzarote which I hope to uh, visit again soon I will definitely go and meet Vince it'll be awesome doing like some kind of like collaboration or an interview with him so let's uh, let's see if I can uh, get that uh, organized and coordinated okay so that was a quick story about my last 24 hours here in Puerto de Carmen. It's, it's definitely been more fun than Costa de Giza. Costa de Giza was fine. And uh, although I'm really, I like the vibe of Puerto de Carmen. You know why? Because you've got all the restaurants, all the bars here, all on one big strip. Uh, we're just coming up to O'Brien's and we've got the galleon here and you know everything is here pretty much right it's all in one place and it'll be interesting going to play a blanca this evening i think i'll get a completely different kind of vibe there um and this guy's just lost his hat on the scooter hopefully can he can get that back and it'll be interesting to contrast costa to geese with uh here Porto de Carmen and then uh, Playa Blanca and then compare the three. I would say last time when I stayed here in Porto de Carmen I, w I definitely preferred uh, you know this place that's also why I came back but just one night here. 
stayed in the apartment. Um, it was okay. It was um, it was like super hot. The apartments didn't have air conditioning in it, which was kind of okay because I opened the window and then at night it got naturally cool. Uh, there was no, well, there was a fan in there, but the fan didn't work. So that was a, another issue. And I would say that it was super warm. When I got there, it must have been about 25 degrees in the room. I mean, it was like cooler outside than it was inside, which is completely bizarre. But uh, there you have it, it is what it is. And I've just come up to Lineker's bar. Hola, hi. And, um, well, this is cool. I didn't see this uh, last time. I kind of walked past it, but I tell you what, let's go and have a quick drink here and I'll see you guys soon.